I think my whole entire life I wanted to be a doctor. I can't remember a time where I wanted to do something else. I don't remember ever saying, oh, I want to be a fireman or a policeman, you know, or an, I, an athlete. I don't think there was ever a time in my life I wanted to do anything else but become a doctor. Undergraduate, I went to UCLA, and there, of course, you know, was when I started to worry about applying to medical schools. And as long as I could remember, I always wanted to be a doctor my whole life. And while I was at UCLA, I volunteered in the emergency room. I thought it was the coolest thing in the whole world. When I was a resident in Northwestern University doing my OBGYN residency, the stuff I loved the most was the obstetrics. And I really loved the high-risk obstetrics, the sick pregnant women. and. When you're OBGYN, you have to send the high-risk pregnant women to the high-risk pregnancy specialist. They go, well, I don't want to do that. I want to keep and take care of them. I don't want someone else. I mean, this was the most challenging obstetrics cases. And I go, I want to be that person where they get shipped to. And that's when, after four years of residency, I decided to do a maternal fetal medicine or high-risk pregnancy um, fellowship. And that's when I went to University of California, Irvine. I had a friend of mine who was at University of Nevada. He said, come here, you know, there's only one group here, and we could become faculty at University of Nevada. And so that's why I ended up coming here in 1996 to join the faculty of University of Nevada. But teaching is something we all want to do. All of us have done residencies and fellowships at university hospitals and all of us very much want to continue teaching. Dr. Adishak is uh, one of the most kind-hearted, caring people, physicians I know. He takes great care of his employees. He goes above and beyond. He gives his patients his cell phone number and he truly wants them to call him any hour of the day. I just received a letter last week who the patient's child turned 10 years old and they sent me a letter saying how much it meant to me that you know saved that child's life and I get a letter 10 years later of how much it meant to her the care I gave now that is way better than anything else we opened up you know a spa for pregnant women basically and my wife had just delivered a couple years earlier and she had some really great ideas how to make you know a spa like what services in Las Vegas were really lacking and now we do yoga for pregnant women and we have classes for pregnant women as well as classes like for baby basics it has just become an evolution into taking care of pregnant women when there really wasn't a place that would do something like that. Dr. Adishak is amazing. Truly such a caring person, cares about all of his patients, cares about all of his employees, really wants to make sure that all of his employees are happy, wants to make sure that their families are happy, wants to make sure that he's providing a good place to come to work and giving people the opportunity to really have a good career and to provide for their families. You know, about 10 years ago, my wife saw on my list of things to do, I think before I die list, was to get pilot's license training. So she set up one lesson for me. I was hooked, I loved it. So I went on to get my private pilot's license. Then I went on to get my instrument rating. And then I went out to buy a plane and I loved it. And then, then there's this charity all over the country called Angel Flight, where these private pilots go out and pick up patients and bring them to where they need medical care if they can't afford to fly places or drive long distances, you know, or they aren't able to drive long distances because they're too sick to do it. We've been through a lot together in the last 12 or 13 years. I truly could never imagine working for another practice, another physician. I trust you with, obviously, 
my life, my family, you've delivered my kids. I truly appreciate you and everything you do for me personally and for the whole staff in general. You're amazing, I love you. Dr. Adishak, congratulations. This is a much deserved award. If there's anybody out there who is making a difference in the community, it's definitely you. You're brilliant and sweet and kind and comforting to so many people, including myself. Bringing my two babies into the world is something that I only share, my husband and I only share with you. So you're amazing. We all love you. Congratulations.